Good morning. I am very happy to say something. And uh, I, I want to put one idea. Thanks to the globalization and to the interfaith and ecumenical dialogue promoted by the Second Vatican Council, the various religions know one another better. On the basis of this new mutual knowledge, religions today are called to act together to promote and defend the human dignity of each person and the body of the person, as well the planet. The loss and waste of food affect both climate change and people's lives and bodies. While the Council foster a dialogue strictly around the religious themes subject, that is to say, what un unite us religious, or what is the difference that we have in the notion of God. And for this, the Pope, uh, Pope Paul VI, uh, organized two, con two different councils. One council for the ecumenical rela rela relation, that is uh, for the Christians, another for the Christian and Jews, another for the dialogue, interreligious dialogue. Today, the accentuation of the Pope is not to especially, but of course, in the basis of this dialogue, relig religious dialogue. But today the accentuation is what we can do together to defend the planet and to defend the dignity of a person. And to defend and to promote the dignity of the planet and, and the dignity of a person and the body of the person that is very affected today. Uh, we don't need to have the same idea of God. And this is the new of the accentuation <laughs> of the Pope Francis. When he invites here all the religious leaders, the more important, just in the beginning of his pontificate, to say we need, in, in, in the name of God, we need to defend the human dignity of a person against to the new form of slaves. And the same, say, to defend the planet against to this uh, crisis of climate change. So, and this is also, in, in, uh, the consequence of this is also that we need to act together to promote and to defend the good food and to avoid the, the lost and waste the food because uh, this is the more important part uh, to, to live to, and to live well and to live with happiness. So, uh, in order to accentuate this novelty, uh, the recent Synod of Amazonia uh, proposed an idea of sin against to nature. This is a new idea, but in some sense it's new. Uh, sins against to nature or sins against to God creator. Uh, and this kind of sin is just uh, go to the possibility of the nature uh, that have in his natural law the, to go against to, to the life of the nature and uh, against to our resources and against to the human being and against to God as creator of the nature. So, uh, and this is, uh, this sin is committed when we not use the natural in a, in a responsible way, or as we say today, 
in a form of sustainable develop or a bioeconomy, I'd say the German people in a very good uh, formulation. So I think the, that is very important, the, the, the idea of the Pope that give for this, the Twitter that the Pope give for this meeting, that imply the prayer of our Lord, uh, that is the model of all Christian prayer for us. But because when we ask God to give us our daily bread, uh, this is also to say that we are disposal to do all the things that are necessary to have this daily bread uh, with the, an idea of sustainable develop, that is to say not to force the natural. So uh, when we ask, the same, when we ask God to give peace is because we are disposed to do all the things that we can do in our hands to, to, to be promoter of peace. So, and for me this implies that uh, we need to respect the nature, we need to respect uh, the possibility of the nature, and this in the production of food and in distribution of food, and of course, in, in, in all this moment of the change of the food, we need uh, to, to avoid loss and to avoid waste uh, in, in, in the production of the food. So, in concretely, we all religious people, people of the faith, and all people, uh, also the people that not have faith, but habitat in, in our common planet, are called to uh, act together to, in the production of food and in distribution of food, in the chain of production, respect uh, an ethic action that is to avoid loss and to avoid waste of the food. Thank you very much.